Hello crafty friends, Alicia from Love Letter Generation. Hope you're all doing well today. I am on here with a Life's Craft Art haul, which is the sister of Coco Rosa Studio. Hence the cute little fox packaging that you see here. They have some new cute Halloween cutting dies in their shop right now, which I'm wanting to share with you. I'll also leave all the links down below in the description box as well as a discount code. So the first Halloween cutting die I have to share with you is this cute little ghost die. It has the word on it, hey boo, which I think is absolutely adorable. You've got the cute little ghost. He has some little hearts. And I already have so many ideas for this cutting die using Halloween inspired colored cardstock. And I think he will look just great on a card or used as like an embellishment. So adorable. And I'm looking forward to playing with this die. The next cutting die is a pumpkin set. So it has your little pumpkin, all the pumpkin leaves, and it is perfect for those of you that do fall inspired crafting. Um, we aren't in fall at the moment, but it is perfect for the Halloween season if you're doing Halloween crafting. I'm looking forward to creating some beautiful pastel colored pumpkins like your pale pinks and your pale oranges and lilac colors. I think it is going to look so gorgeous. And it comes with so many different like foliage pieces. I absolutely love it. And you could use this for all year round crafting. The next cutting die is so interesting. I had never seen anything quite like it before, but I think it's going to turn out so cute. You've got this gorgeous like pumpkin sort of trick or treat. What would you call it? Like a candy bucket, I guess. And it comes with some really fun pieces. So I'm going to lay out all the pieces for you just to give you a quick example of how you can use this cutting die. But I will also have project shares on my channel and over on my Instagram page as well. So I'm just pulling all the pieces apart and I'm going to show you how I plan on layering this die up. So you've got your cute little pumpkin like bucket sort of piece here. And then this layering piece, which you could use on for the front or the back of the pumpkin. Um, preferably, I think it'd be better to go at the back. You can use like a different colored cardstock for that. You then have your cute little handle. So it turns into like your little um, Halloween candy bucket. You've got the little ghosts which you can pop inside or coming out of it. You've got bats. And all these pieces will work with any Halloween crafty projects. You can use the bats separate. You can use the ghosts separate. You could do the bucket separate. If you had some little like candy uh, or lolly related cutting dies, you could even pop those into your jack-o'-lantern candy bucket. I love that little ghost there with his little um, face like going, oh. <laughs> So I believe this cutting die is going to make some really cute 
Halloween crafty projects. This next cutting die is also very versatile for your Halloween crafting. You can use all the different pieces how you like. Comes with a big giant spider web, which I absolutely love. Perfect for um, using as like a layering piece in the background or using as a main embellishment. It also gives you the letters to spell out trick or treat and all the other little cute accessories like little ghosts, little pumpkins, tiny little bats. I'm really looking forward to cutting this die out using some gorgeous black glitter cardstock and then some of my favorite Halloween inspired colors for the alphas. I think it is going to look so pretty. Just look at how tiny that little bat is there and those little pumpkins. So adorable. And this little piece here is the or in the trick or treat. Such a great sized die and extremely versatile for all types of Halloween crafting. You can mix and match this with any of your Halloween dies. So thank you for watching my die haul. I will be showing some project shares real soon, so keep your eye out for those. Please don't forget to go check out Life's Craft Art website. I will leave their link down below. And also there's the 25% um, off discount code as well for when you purchase items on their website. And let me know down below which of these cutting dies you prefer out of the four. I really love the spider web trick or treat die and also the fall pumpkin die. I think I am going to have the most fun with those two, but all of these cutting dies are just so cute. Thank you for watching. Take care. Bye.